Hello everyone and welcome to our Rhapsody reading. Today is the 3rd of December and our title is Focus on the Lord and His Kingdom. Our shouting scripture is from Isaiah 9 verse 7 and it reads, Of the increase of His government and peace there shall be no end upon the throne of David and upon His kingdom to order it and to establish it with judgment and with justice from henceforth even forever. The zeal of the Lord of hosts will perform this. Pastor Chris says, David prophesied of a king who will rule over the nations of the world. He said in Psalm 72 verse 8, he shall have dominion also from sea to sea and from the river unto the ends of the earth our opening scripture says concerning that king of the increase of his government and peace there shall be no end the lord jesus heads the kingdom of god and of which we're a part of it's a real kingdom a functional spiritual kingdom Our consciousness of the kingdom is important. We can't focus our minds on this earth as though everything ends here. There's a world that's greater than this. Hallelujah. Colossians 3 verse 1 to 2 says, Seek those things which are above, where Christ seated on the right hand of God. Set your affection on things above, not on things on the earth. How? By being steadfast, unmovable, always abounding in the work of the Lord. For as much as ye know that your labor is not in vain in the Lord. Hallelujah. 1 Corinthians 15 verse 58. These are the last days. Fix your gaze on the Lord and his kingdom. Make him your focus. Be on fire for the Lord all the time. Be instant in season and out of season proclaim his truth hallelujah you may read the confession after me you may (laughs) you may recite the confession after me say i've been transferred from the domain of darkness to the kingdom of god's love son though i'm in the world I'm conscious of the heavenly kingdom. I function from the realm of the spirit. And nothing in this physical matters. Nothing in this physical world matters to me. And indeed, through the unstoppable spread of the gospel, Our kingdom reigns over nations. Amen. And for further study, you may read 1 Corinthians 15 verse 58, Romans 8 verse 5 to 6, and Colossians 3 verse 1 to 4. And for our one-year Bible reading plan, you may read from 1 John 4 and Daniel 1 to 2. And our second-year Bible reading plan, you may read Revelation 6 verse 11 to 17 and Joel 3. Have a wonderful day and see you again tomorrow with another Rhapsody reading. God bless you.